Hello there! This is Oprah Red Scissors, and welcome to another episode of Let's Discuss. Today, I am uh, going to show you some interesting photos that I have found on the internet or created myself. The purpose of this series is just to discuss what I really like about images, fan art, memes or anything and the things that left me on me a huge impact. So, let's begin. Last night I was watching a video about Darth Maul's childhood and uh, there was an image of some Jedi or someone being stabbed by a blue blade and this guy, for me at least, seems incredibly similar to Snoke. I mean, he has a very similar scar, a very similar face, uh, he uh, has, he is wearing something like a bathrobe, just the same as Snoke weared in The Last Jedi. And he is being stabbed by a blue blade in shock, just like Snoke was when uh, Kylo activated Ray's bl uh, blade. It really seems like Snoke to me. Tell me if you see the similarity in the comments below. In Rogue One, director Krennic was always requesting to meet the Emperor to discuss the Death Star. However, when he came to Darth Vader, Darth Vader basically said like, the Emperor is busy, he doesn't need you. But if Krennic did go, this is a picture that I have created of what the meeting might have looked like. I also created a sort of scary Palpatine standing in his office. As the Clone Wars did have Palpatine's good face, but I don't really think that they did it good. So when I placed it as Palpatine's evil face, it really worked. With the Emperor's hologram seen from The Empire Strikes Back constantly being updated due to the special edition changes, I have found a fan version of this thing which I really like and enjoy because it seems more like a Return of the Jedi style Emperor than a prequel style Emperor. And uh, yeah, I like that the fans did that just for our enjoyment. Captain Paneka, uh, the queen's loyal servant, when it came to the empire, he became one of the governors, aka Moths, for the planet Naboo, which was also the homeworld of Emperor Palpatine. I really like that they made a picture of him being old, like as, uh, as the Moth, and what I want to ask, if anyone knows, is this actually the actor going just to f taking a photo uh, just to sort of make this? Or is it a fan-made picture? Because if it is sort of like uh, the actual actor, I really respect that because uh, he, ta he must have taken a lot of time just for the to please the fans. However, I'm not sure. It might just be a uh, fun fan uh, art, but I think even if it is, it is very good. I also enjoyed this artwork of young Palpatine and his master Darth Plagueis standing beside each other, thinking of evil plans. Palpatine's young face looks really good on this uh, artwork. And speaking of young faces, one person on the internet tried to make a young Palpatine using Photoshop and I think he did it pretty well. What do you think? Tell me in the comments below. I also like this picture of the three female characters from the prequel trilogy, aka Padme. Uh, the original trilogy, Leia, and the sequel trilogy, Rey. They are really good in this picture, because they seem very similar. I also like this photo of young Han Solo, played by the new actor, uh, the, the young Harrison Ford Han Solo, and the old Harrison Ford Han Solo. 
They are done very good, and I really like those pictures. Props to all the people who uh, enjoy doing those kind of uh, sort of fan-made stuff because they look absolutely amazing. There have been a thousand theories about who Snoke is, and we still don't quite know. However, I think he is a completely new character by now, but uh, there are still a lot of speculation going on. And one of the theories is that he is the Grand Inquisitor from Star Wars Rebels Season 1. The Grand Inquisitor was an evil force user, not a Sith, who was basically uh, working for, how do you say it, working for Darth Vader and trying to kill or turn to the dark side all the remaining Jedi who survived Order 66. He was, however, uh, thrown into an explosion. And in this picture, it shows how he may have become Snoke after he uh, sort of, uh, after his wounds. I have also created this, which shows how Darth Jar Jar may have been Snoke and how his transformation into the Supreme Leader might have went. As a bonus to this video, I will create a little Snoke Try Not To Laugh challenge with funny faces and funny jokes. My worthy apprentice, son of darkness, heir apparent to Lord Vader, where there was conflict, I now sense resolve. Where there was weakness, strength. Complete your training and fulfill your destiny. I know what I have to do. You think you can turn him? <laughs> 